So man, I've been waiting to do this video for a minute because I didn't have my Gear VR. And in the time of uh, me getting my Gear VR back, somebody already put it up and I should have shared the good news. But yeah, man, uh, this is pretty much how to run your Google Cardboard apps or Google Cardboard apps on your Samsung Gear VR. Uh, yeah, man, shout out to the Reddit, Reddit user who beat me to it. Uh, now, this ain't something new, man. I've been doing this for a long time, but the way that it's being done now is flawless as far as like the execution wise. Uh, I had to rig, you know what I'm saying? I would, I would normally, back in the day, because I've been running Google Cardboard apps since I got this back in December, but I would put the, uh, the, you know, the phone like not all the way in because the minute that that, you know, micro USB connection gets put into the phone, it goes into the VR mode, you know what I'm saying? So I would just put it in there a little bit, you know what I'm saying? I would just run it that way. But this new way, you actually have to go in. Uh, so that's for the, the people who don't want to pay to do it. You can do it that way. Or you can go into the Play Store, download this amazing app called Package Disabler. I've been using it for a million and one things. Uh, this is just another one of those awesome things you can use it for. So once you open it up, you're going to go in and you're going to turn off... Uh, you give VR service, if I can remember right. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Let's see. Yep, give VR service. So you just turn that off. At first, I was testing everything. I was turning off everything. Then I found out you only have to turn off the give VR service. So once that's turned off, you can go ahead, open up your cardboard. And matter of fact, we're gonna go ahead and uh, yeah, we're gonna open up cardboard or whatever you want and you can run your game so what I'm about to do is I'm actually about to record uh, we about to record what I'm seeing so you can see it let's go in and we're gonna do bam should have had this already ready my bad start and just wait a couple seconds I'm sorry but yeah now that it's set up uh, the fun begins. I'm gonna go ahead and watch this insidious trailer. Hopefully, I don't get flagged and shit. So, um, let's get it. Matter of fact, yeah, and I watched the first half of it, like the first, not half. I watched like the first five seconds of this, and I had to stop myself. We putting it on, we putting it on camera. So, here we go. Uh, get your headset, all of that stuff. I ain't worried about it. But now, as I put it in, if you can see, like I see. Well, I have to cover up the sensor. Well, no, not even have to cover up the sensor. Man, fuck that. I'm putting this shit on. Oh, it's behind me. Oh, shit. I almost knocked over my camera. So I'm in this fucking room. And um, the thing that sucks about this shit, the VR experience in... The virtual reality experience in cardboard has always been trash to me because, like, the head tracking is shit. It's not using all these accelerometers, man. Like, that's, like, the worst part. Just make the apps compatible and stop fucking playing. Man, anyway, so it's laggy as hell in my eyes. But when I watched it on the video after I recorded it, I did, you know, a test run. Video looks good, so hopefully y'all can see it good. But let's get it started. Looking at it hip again. Oh, just looking up again. Damn, I'm hitting shit. I can't even see nothing. Damn. All right, yeah, so red door. You know it's always bad when you're going through a red door. Red balloons and shit. Yeah, and this fucked me up. This motherfucker closed the window from the outside, bro. Okay, now this is what I picked up. Oh, shit. The fuck? Oh shit. See this that shit man. Look at this shit. What's going on? This motherfucker. Bitch, why that candle light? Why the fuck you sitting with a candle? See, man, it's that bullshit. See? Some fucking bullshit, motherfucker. <laughs> this inviting demons into your house, man.
Nah, bruh. See, man. The fuck out. That's that bullshit, man. See, I ain't fucking... Oh, that's why you got a candle. Them lights be going on. You used to this shit. Nah, bro. Oh, I seen this effect. My buddy did this in his video. That bitch ready, bro. Man, nah. I ain't fucking with this shit no more. Jukeboxes. See, look at this shit, man. Nah, man, the KKK in this bitch, too. Man, nah, fuck no. Fuck no. All right, man, I give up. I wasn't going to wear headphones, and I'm smart for not wearing them shits. Get the fuck out of here. I knew something was going to jump right in front of my face. I was ready for it. I wasn't even scared of that shit. Come on now. But yeah, uh, so now it's dope because when I was watching it, the cheat code way, just, you know, halfway putting it in there, I couldn't really, uh, in theaters this summer. Damn, I guess I didn't even see that movie. But yeah, I couldn't, I couldn't get the full view because it was kind of halfway lifted. Now I get to see the full view in VR uh, from Cardboard. And I'm not, you know, I mean, it's got great content. That's the best part. You got great content. You get to see the YouTube 360 videos without having to download them. Uh, so that's cool. But man, is this shit laggy. The head tracking sucks ass. That's why the Gear VR wins again. Um, but yeah, so that's how to do it. And um, yeah, I will not be watching this again. And I suggest you don't watch it with headphones. Uh turned up loud at all. That's some bullshit, man. That's some straight bullshit. Yeah.